Hello everybody, Nathaniel from Marcy Insight here, and today I am reviewing 2023 LEGO City set 60393, the 4x4 Fire Truck Rescue. This set has 97 pieces and comes with one minifigure as well as a cat piece and retails for $9.99 in the United States, $13.99 in Canada. This is one of several new $10 LEGO City sets to come out on January 1st, so let's jump straight into the review. And as always, we will start off with our minifigure. This set features one female firefighter who is holding a fish on a stick, which we will get to later. As for the figure itself, it features both printed legs and torso pieces. I'm not sure if these are new prints for 2023, but if they are, they are not radically different from the previous fire minifigure prints. We do get that relatively new fire helmet piece, which as a piece I quite like, but it is in the neon yellow color Lego introduced a few years ago, which I absolutely despise. For the face, we have just one print where our minifigure is smiling and has a pair of glasses. The set features one small side build with a somewhat simplistic tree and a tiny campfire. This is all built on a single green plate piece and there isn't really anything too special about what we get here. This is supposed to be a fall tree, however, so we get these leaf pieces in yellow and orange, which is something I appreciate. I wish we got more fall colors and foliage from LEGO in general, but the leaf coverage here does feel slightly lacking, even if the leaves are supposed to be falling off the trees. We have a cat that is stuck up in the tree that our firefighter is trying to rescue, which is no doubt where the fish on a stick comes into play as a means to coax the cat down. Then there is also a ladder here that is clipped onto the ground and goes part way up the tree. The flames for the campfire are detached from the campfire base. I assume this is for playability so you can knock out the flames with the water gun launcher we get in this set, but personally, I really don't like that the flames sit loose on top of the campfire base and it feels rather lazy to me. Moving on to the fire truck itself, it is a fairly simple build, but I think it looks decent overall. It has the new turning function wheels, as well as clips on the side for the water gun and ladder. On the front, there is a printed piece with the fire logo, though it is on that neon yellow color that I have already mentioned I don't like. The neon yellow does serve as the accent color to the red here, but aside from the printed piece on the front, its presence is pretty minimal, so it doesn't bother me too much. Inside, there is a steering wheel and space enough for our one firefighter minifigure to sit. At the front, we have some lights and a grill piece attached to a 1x4 plate with knobs on it. For some reason, I think this looks really weird and it doesn't make a lot of sense. I can't pinpoint exactly what I don't like about it. I just think it looks silly and the longer you look at it, it, it I don't know, it just doesn't work for me personally. At the back, we have a little truck bed space with a small crate that clips onto a jumper tile. And inside, we have some additional one by one transparent blue tiles, which serve as additional water pieces for the gun. Overall, I like a lot of what is happening in this set. I have some small nitpicks, be it the front grill area of the fire truck, the neon yellow, or the loose campfire piece, but on a whole, I think it is a decent set. There's nothing that really stands out to me. The tree build is what you would expect from LEGO City, nothing great, but certainly serviceable, and the fire truck build feels compact and clean with nice dimensions. It is far from my favorite $10 LEGO set, but I like it more than the Fire Chief car set from a couple years ago. This is one of the better $10 fire sets we've had in a long time, and at its price point, I don't think anyone will be disappointed with this buy. It's far from a must-have set, but it is a nice, small, and cheap set that would make a great gift or a solid complimentary piece for a LEGO City display. That is going to be it for my review of the 4x4 Fire Truck Rescue, though. If you liked this video, click the like button down below. It is a great way for you to show your support. Tell me you like this kind of content. Subscribe for more videos like this. I have a bunch of LEGO reviews coming out. I had a big LEGO haul that I did on January 1st, so you can check out that haul video. You can see the reviews I've already put out and what reviews you can expect in the coming days. So again, if that interests you, subscribe so you can see those videos as soon as they come out. And with all that said, I just want to say thank you so much for watching this video, guys, and I will see you all in the next one.